Good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome to the neighborhood. This is Sophia from Sophia Brings Light. As again, we go through our journey through the tarot, which I kind of will go through um, probably over the next couple of weeks just to, um, you know, it's my personal journey studying some of the major arcana cards. And eventually I'll talk about some other cards, but I'm going to intersperse that with other things. But anyway, let's go back to the, our journey through the tarot and our journey through the tarot takes us to the Queen of Cups. Again, this card is coming from Angel Wisdom Tarot, which I'm enjoying this deck. So I'm just kind of reviewing some of the cards of the major arcana. And I will do that over the next couple of weeks. And if you go back over some of my other videos, I have done some other like card reviews and stuff. But the Queen of Cups, let's talk about her. And this card is pretty, The and I can see that in the beauty of this card. The Queen of Cups represents a person filled with love, and she embodies all an encompassing, never wavering compassion. She also represents not only a person, but um, an, an environment of never ending love. So it also suggests a lovely atmosphere. Essentially, this card reminds us that this nurturing backdrop to life is one we should all try to attain in order to live in a mutual respect and harmony with each other. So that's also good and something that we need in this day and time. It also suggests that this love that we need this compassionate, loving, giving, mutual respect of others is not something we can demand from some other people, but love that we must find within ourselves. So that, my loves, is the Queen of Cup. And I also, at the end of the cards in this deck, they have always some um, little something to read. I had to move the flower there. But it says this card, uh, for this card, it says loving, compassionate, psychic, self-sacrificing, deep psychic insights, caring for others, but forgetting to take care of yourself. Trust your intuition, a deep love of family and friends, follow your heart. And then this card to me, she's carrying the, or she's holding the cup, sitting in her regal chair and being her regal self as she looks out over into the ocean. Um, I see in this card, you know, I'm just doing my intuitive reading. So I give you the traditional reading of what it means and then intuitively what I get from it is that um, we do carry within us the loving compassion and intuition that we need. We just sometimes have to take the time to reflect and tap into that intuitive, loving, compassionate person that we are. And in this day and time, to have that mutual respect for others, to be compassionate to other people, to be reflectful and insightful. Uh, and in here is saying that psychic uh, insights, that sometimes to develop that, to tap into those things, we have to take the time to come to self, to be reflective spend time and meditation and um, self-reflection in order to tap into those compassionate uh, parts of ourselves, providing that deep love, concern, and respect for others. Again, I still feel in, that this taps into that divine feminine energy in us, just like um, the Empress card telling us to that these insights of love and compassion are uh, really great, great assets for that feminine energy. And these are assets that help us grow and to be all that we can be and that we need time to reflect, time to tap into those insights. So that's pretty much that. I also, my husband gave me a gift and I wanted to show it to you guys. And we got this thing from Amazon. So I'm going to go away from the card. And this right here is the gift. Just showing you that. Um, this is a lighter. And I think it's, and you guys may have seen this, but sometimes I'm behind the time. 
It lights your candles by the use of that, like pushing a button and that comes on. Kind of go away from it a little bit. I'm loving this thing. You charge it. I don't have to worry about having lighters or matches, which I run out of all the time anyway. So it just is really nice. Again, we got this off of Amazon. And I'm going to show it to you again. And it is from Tamalo. Trying to see the name, if you can see that. Yeah, Tamalo. Um, again, I got that out for Amazon, and I thought I'd show that because maybe for somebody it might be a great thing. Um, again, this is not, I'm too small a channel, but when I find useful items and useful things, I'm going to pass that on to you. Um, again, we talked about the Queen of Cups. So you guys have a blessed, compassionate, loving week, just like the Queen of Cups, and be blessed. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.